Sports clubs are part of the fabric of Brazilian society. In Belo Horizonte, Minas Tennis Club boasts 73,000 members at its four locations across the city. The main site was originally earmarked for a zoo, but the wife of the city's mayor eventually convinced her husband to allow the construction of a sports club instead. So, in November 1935, Minas Tennis Club opened its doors. One of our main aims is to help people develop. We have an enormous structure, we spend money, but we cannot forget health, education, principles and values. So the essence of Minas really is to preserve all of these values, so that from sport, from this learning through sport, athletes can transfer skills to their lives as a whole. Whilst Minas Tennis Club runs a futsal programme, it doesn't cater for football, which is easily the most popular sport here in Brazil. There are eight different sports on offer to the members, but the most popular nowadays is volleyball, a sport in which Brazil has won four Olympic titles since 1992. Still, not everyone can be an Olympic champion. This is not an industry. It's not a company. It belongs to the associates, to the associated members. So the member's satisfaction is our main goal. That's our objective. This is what we strive for. This is how we run it. And this is why we manage the club the way we do. Like all Brazilian sports clubs, Minas Tennis Club is first and foremost a social club. But it does boast close to a thousand athletes who have either experienced the Olympics already or are seeking to do so in Rio de Janeiro in 2016. And with such impressive facilities at their disposal, there's every chance that they will be successful. I think one of the main differences between Minas and a football club is the continuity from one president to another. And this is one of the secrets of our success. The structure and programmes never change, and that has led to great stability down the years. Every four years, the club's 73,000 members elect a council from within, and they, in turn, cast votes for a president and board of directors, who produce a roadmap for the club, which the staff will then implement. Members range from the very young to the city's senior citizens, so there is something for everyone to enjoy. It's an impressive club in impressive surroundings, so much so that the British Olympic Association has chosen Minas Tennis Club to be its training base ahead of the 2016 Olympic Games. Minas is very excited by this opportunity to host the British Olympic Committee. We are three years from the Olympic Games, but this partnership with the British Olympic Association already means a lot to the club. We really are very satisfied with this arrangement that we've reached with Great Britain. And I think that in return for offering our facilities, we will gain by what we learn from our guests from Great Britain. Almost 80 years since its formation, Minas Tennis Club continues to grow. It's already the biggest sports club in Brazil, and the cultural events it regularly puts on are a big draw with the members. Well managed, with plenty of sponsors on board, the future looks rosy for this impressive institution.